Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 52 in chapter 15. Chapter 15 is about waves. So we look at this system. At the very beginning, we have the oscillator at this end, right? The fundamental frequency by this oscillator is given. And then it just oscillates. Then there is the standing wave between these two ends. The length of this standing wave, the two ends, uh, is given. And also the leader density for this string is given. And over a pulley, it connected with the mass. The mass, we need to find it, all right? So we need to find the mass uh, of this end to produce one loop, two loop, five loop of standing waves. So it looks like, because first we look at there is a standing wave between these two ends. And also the frequency by these standing waves is in this function. We did the proof in previous questions. And we can see in this function, n is an integral. L is a constant, right? L is given, and mu is given. The only thing unknown is Ft, because there we need to provide one loop, two loop, three loop, right? So n is one, two, or five. Now Ft, how can we get Ft? We look at this mass, we find it's balanced. So that means the tension on the string equal to the gravity on this mass. Do you agree? Yes. So now we can input this uh, F mass inside. So replace Ft with the mg. And then we can get the function for the Ft and the mass and this uh, part. So now we get the function for the mass in this function. And inside this function, you can see L is given, F is given, mu is given, G is a constant, N is 1, 2, or 5. Can you find the mass? Sure, so easy, right? So first time when the N is 1, and then so this there is 1, then we get the mass, look like this one. When the N is 2, it is 2 squared, input also quantity, get the answer there. When n is 5, input 5 inside, get the answer there. Thank you.